Hey you guys and welcome back to episode 10 with Eremakun where we finally got introduced to one of the characters that was teased to us in the opening of Baram Sensei where based on first impression he is already quite the character. So I honestly can't wait to meet him and just see how his interaction with the trio will go down but on top of that we can't forget that we went to Baram Sensei because we finally found the subject that Edema was good at because we do have exams coming up and if we fail the exams we do drop down a rank so there is a lot on the line so let us get into things if you guys want to watch fuller anime make sure to check out the link above our synchronizing video at two minutes and eight seconds in three two one go but how's a lesson huh oh essie oh everyone clara's just fit right in Why did you specifically pick him at that exact moment? Oh. Does everyone get head past? He? Chalk? Other imaginary beasts, uh huh. Because of skin chip. Oh, he's not as scary or bad as I thought. Oh, nah, he actually looks like a big softy. It almost suddenly feels chill. Give them a thumbs up. Never mind. <laughs> I was just thinking of that um, school theme song in my head. Oh dear. to know this. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's oddly very, you know, peaceful. Oh no, have we been caught already? Oh my god, he's literally run off with Enema. No fun, no fun, Clara, no fun. We've been caught. Um, he's, he's just has tiny baby wings. Yeah, exactly. I can tell by touching. Um, um, is this not sexual harassment? Um, hey, oh, Ellie, oh, no fair, no fair. Yeah, see, tiny, tiny, tiny wings. Woo! 
There's a fact that he just like stripped off everything. Yeah, okay, the sensei might be like unintentionally troublesome than we thought. <gasps> Not so fast, Missy. We just have a teeny, tiny, tiny, tiny. Let me lick you. No. He's just gonna go for a lick. A nice solid lick. Oh, he is a big softy. Oh, I like bottom sensei. I told you, he just gave him really good vibes. I don't know, I just think anyone that, like, Clara's cool around, like, I like how they were just cozying up. Oh. So <laughs> I know he's just said yes last week terrified me but he's so sweet <laughs> he's like the perfect amount of like awkward adorableness of sweetness of kindness of just mixture mixture of everything a little pal puff girl spice recipe. Hmm? Uh, I am very human like. Oh, fuck it, what did you do? <laughs> Fuck, I love it. Is that not? I'm human like. I like human studies. Oh, Irma. No, 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 no. Leave us there. Sensei? Are you so excited? No tail. Oh my god, he's terrified of us! How bad? I told you he's nervous! Oh, look at that blush! Oh, bless! No, he probably just wants to... <laughs> Get him there. Give him a hug. <laughs> I okay. Newton. Oh my god. Why do I love him? So he's a bit of like. 
Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Yeah. Just fully let down our guard. Yeah, no, no, no disagreements there. Uh <laughs> How are you masking? Good stuff. Yeah, but I'm just really just got our guard down, I think. How oh, beautiful the school anthem. <laughs> You clearly crammed very hard. <laughs> Abzi? Is that not everyone? Oh no, we do have some smart cookies. That is true, that is true. <laughs> Why don't you guys like do it in sections? Well, yeah, I'm kind of surprised, but good on you. Good boy. Why is that exciting? Yes. Oh, is that the amusement park? The blood pool. I'll pass on the blood pool. Everything else sounds good. Oh. Oh no, Edema's never done these things. Oh. Now we have to pass. Yes. If we pass. If we pass. Yeah, I don't mean to be Calgo Sensei, but I was a Calgo Sensei. I'm sorry. Oh, oh. Always? No idea why. Hey, Sensei! <laughs> He's not creepy, guys. Don't worry. <laughs> There's beef. Childhood friends. <laughs> that is how. Yay, they are bros. An odd combination, but it kind of works. Maybe because you were in the corner breathing really heavily, but no, I don't think that had anything to do with it. <laughs> oh. <gasps> Sensei, help? Yeah. You 
da. Mental measuring. A lot of training. Rarity of things. Bloodline magic. They had pancakes together. I love how that's my takeaway from this lesson. And <laughs> they had pancakes. <laughs> yeah, but that, that was really good. And adorable. Oh, 666 be so Yay, the pictures are adorable. Oh. Yeah, I knew we could learn so much in such a simple book. Uh-huh. Just accept it. <laughs> go, Irma, go. Nice to learn a little bit of history. Nicely done. That would be fun. <laughs> Just accept it. For the... Mm-hmm. What subject is this? <laughs> Welcome. <laughs> A lonely torturer. In the history of torture. <laughs> I want that tissue box. What? <laughs> A lonely torturer too. <gasps> oh, that's a pass. That's a that's a that's a solid absolute pass. Oh, we just need to get forty. Oh, you you're sweet then. <laughs> I mean, it's better than the single digits we just upgraded from. I think you have to book upside down. Oh no, you're all right. Oh, I love how everyone bought like the skills um, to help each other. Class is always cheerful. <laughs> yeah, no. <laughs> but yes. Something definitely Irma. Tiny little thought.
Is it time? Oh. Go in, my go. Go, everyone. Go on, Mr. Class. Oh, I should say Royal Ones Class. No. Oh, I love this episode. I did not. Where do I even start? Okay. Firstly, the study aspect of things. It's, yeah, I think this is one big thing I definitely love about, like, you know, just our whole class is that friendship, that bond that we have within this entire classroom that we have with every member in the class. And that's, a, it was really nice um, seeing everyone like study together, you know, Erma learning history through gaming and some plants. I'm going to take a guess and say plants to like Clara singing. It's just, I liked how everyone, once again, it's kind of like how we got into the Royal Ones class of how everyone brought their unique skills to be able to pass, you know, to be complete the task. So I like that whole kind of like, yeah, you know, power of friendship moment once again. It was just, it's a moment that was, uh, I, I just personally really liked it. Um, yeah, it was just a really nicely well done moment. And then the biggest thing, but I'm sensei, I did not know I would freaking like him so much. I, he's just a big goofball of just like adorable sweetness. Who knew he was just going to be a big, he's like a big softy bear. And absolutely just like so sweet. I don't know. The moment he let Clower just like kind of, I don't know, be, be all around him. And he was like so cool with that. And he was giving everyone had pets. I was just like, I don't think sensei is as bad as everyone makes him out to be and he wasn't he was just a sweetie patootie Tsukima oh this is what I mean oh <laughs> He's like a big mama bird. Like he's, yeah, just, I, I freaking, I love Barnum Sensei. I don't know why, but he's, I like him. He's a stamp of approval. But yeah, it does look like with the end of this episode, the biggest obstacle we have to overcome is the excess. But look at the fact that Inama did get 55. Like you guys got to understand that's about 10 times the improvement from his original scores of like threes, fives. I think the highest one he had was like eight or nine. So like that is a solid improvement. So I think we've got this test in the bag and that means that we are going to have the fun summer vacation and as teas we might go to like a water park and then they have the theme park as well. So there's just so many fun things ahead for Edema that he's never got to experience before. So yeah, definitely looking forward to next week's episode as I just want to see them all pass and celebrate their hard work and studies. So I guess until then, make sure you guys stay awesome and I'll definitely catch you guys next time.